Alright, so let me show you how ChatGPT can help you with writing. Whether it's book, essay, article, or even master thesis, the process of writing can seem overwhelming. First, you have to come up with an idea and then choose a title that stands out. Next, you have to spend a lot of time researching and gathering information. Then you have to create an outline and start writing the first draft. And after that, you have to revise and edit your work to make it polished and grammatically correct. Finally, you have to publish and share your work. So those steps, it might take really a lot of hard work and long time to finish. But you are not alone anymore. We have the chat GPT that can assist you to speed up the process and make your work more efficient. All right, so let's start with the first step of writing a book is to generate an idea. So we have first to find a niche that is interesting to write about. The idea should be trending and as well, not that crowded. So we can use the help of ChatGPT to generate ideas and suggest niches. So let's see what it can do. Let's have the following prompts. Suggest five niche ideas for writing a book that are likely to go viral in 2023 and are less crowded. Let's go. This is really beautiful. So now we have five niches from the AI. The first one about the environment, the next one about the mental health. But let's say that you didn't find the niche that you want to write about. What you can do now, you can add a follow-up prompt to say, suggest three more. So let's go and do that. Give me three more ideas. This is really amazing. So now we have three more niches and now I'm gonna choose a topic. So we're gonna talk about the personal finance, and I would like to make a book about it. All right, so next we're gonna go in more details where we can ask the ChatGPT to give us book ideas about the topic personal finance. So let's do that. All right, so let's try this prompt. I want to write a book about the topic number six. Suggest five book ideas. Let's go. This is really awesome. Now we have ideas for books to write about. I would like to write a book for beginners to explain the basics about investing. All right, and now the next step is to find the catchy titles for my book that can help to draw readers attention and make them more likely to pick up my book. So let's see how ChatGPT can help us with that. Generate five catchy book titles about investing for beginners. I really love it. So now we have a niche, we have an idea, we have a title for our book. We have something in hand and we can start writing the book. All right, guys. So the next step in the process of writing a book is to do research and gather information. Like, for example, reading books, articles, blogs, any online materials you find it in the internet. And here we can use ChatGPT to speed up this very long process. For example, here we have the Wikipedia about the investments and it's pretty long text. So what we can do about it, we can copy the text from the Wikipedia and then go to ChatGPT. GPT and ask it to make a summarizations about it. And that's way faster than reading the whole Wikipedia and extracting the key points of that. So let's have an example. I'm gonna go over here and copy the text until this point. Let's go now to ChatGPT and now I'm gonna ask it to summarize the following text in one paragraph. And now to insert our text, we have to add double quotes so the AI can understand when our text starts and when it ends. So let's do that, double quotes, then paste the whole text and enter. Oh my god, this is really mind blowing. In few seconds, the AI understood the whole text and generated summarizations about it. You just witnessed the magic of neural networks on speeding up the process of AI. And that's why we have response in few seconds. And we can do many other stuff like for example, we can turn it into bullet points. Turn the text into bullet points. Go. This is crazy, right? We have now bullet points from a long text and it's gonna just speed up our process of writing. And now we can go and extract more stuff from the text, like for example, pull out the five most important keywords 
from the text. So as you can see, we have it. Now imagine that we have a lot of books, a lot of articles, blogs, and so on to read and to summarize. How fast now it's gonna be with the AI? You will just gather and collect informations with high speed. So now we have the idea, the title, we investigated about the topic, we should start now writing. And the next step is to create an outline to structure our book. And we can use the help of ChatGPT to generate the outline. So let's see how we can do that. We're gonna write the following. Provide me with an outline for my book. And we have this one. Let's go. This is just awesome. So let's see what do we have here. It's really detailed. So it starts with introduction, then understanding the concept, I think, stocks, pounds, and so on, then setting the goals. I think it's really perfect one. All right, so as you can see, in few seconds, we have an outline. We have a structure and plan for our book. But don't forget one thing, that everything that we get from ChatGPT, it's like suggestions. It is a great start point for us. And if you're really taking your book seriously, you have to edit it and add your personal touch. All right, so now we have the plan and we can start writing the first chapter. And we can use ChatGPT to generate the text for us. All right, so now if you want to ask ChatGPT to generate a text for us, we have to be more specific about the output from the AI. And we can use this formula in order to ask ChatGPT to write something. So we can start with write then the length and then the topic and in which style for example write 1000 words blog on traveling in engaging personal and storytelling style and another prompt for example write 200 words article on health habits in informative and objective style so after trying a lot of stuff in ChatGPT, i think this formula is very successful and you can use it to generate any text you want and i'm really interested if you unlock any successful formula in ChatGPT, share it with us in the video comments so we can all benefit from that so we can say generate 1000 words for the first chapter in an engaging and storytelling style. Let's go. This is really beautiful. I should have asked maybe for 100, it took a little bit more time. All right, so now let's say that you went through the chapter and you think, okay, everything is fine. The text is fine, the ideas, the structure, but I really didn't like the style of it. So you can change the style by using the following prompts. Now write it in the style of a video game dialogue. Let's go. All right. So now we have like NPC and player. This is really funny. All right. And so you can learn how to invest. <laughs> but I will stop it. You can stop this generation by clicking over here. So we don't waste the resources. All right, guys. So now let's say that I went crazy and I start writing the text for chapter two of my book without letting the AI to generate it. And I wrote something like this. We still can use the help of AI to correct the grammar and the punctuations of our text. So let's do that. So we can write it like this, correct the grammar and add punctuation to this text. So we add our text now and let's go. This is really beautiful. So in few seconds, ChatGPT correct everything and repairs my mistakes. I really wish that ChatGPT existed as I was writing my master thesis, where I spent days revising, editing, fixing my grammar. It was not easy task at all. All right, guys. So now if you read my text, I think those words are really simple and I don't sound like professional writer. So let's ask ChatGPT to change that. Replace my simple words with advanced English. Wow, now I'm convinced that I shouldn't write the chapter 2 
I should have like let the AI to generate it. All right, guys. So now I want to take a moment to talk about using AI in the writing process. It's really important to understand that ChatGPT or any other AI tools they will not replace the human writers. Instead, it's here to assist us and make the writing process much faster and more efficient. And we have to remember that everything the AI generates should be reviewed and edited by human to make sure it fits your projects. So let's embrace the AI and never forget the importance of the human touch. All right, guys, I'm really interested to hear your opinion about this topic, ChatGPT, and how you are using it in your daily basis. And if you like my content and you want to support the channel, then I really appreciate it if you support, like, and comment. This is really gonna help the YouTube algorithm. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.